we are about to solve another inequality where we use the number line method. So let's talk about when we use parentheses and when we use brackets using the interval notation. If your inequality symbol is less than or greater than, all your endpoints get parentheses. If your inequality symbol is less than or equal to or greater than or equal to, all endpoints of your intervals get brackets except those that come from the denominator. Now you'll know what I mean as we solve the next inequality. I'd like to solve this inequality. Why do we use the number line method? This is an inequality with variables in the denominator. So how do we solve or what goes on the number line? Values that make the denominator zero. If you set the denominator equal to zero and solve by factoring, you'll have negative three and three as values that make the denominator zero. Then remember, you also solve the related equation. That would be 7x minus 14 over x squared minus 9 is equal to 0. By the way, how do you begin solving this equation? Multiply both sides by the LCD. Do not forget that 0 times the LCD is 0. And once you solve, you'll have x is 2. So I'll place 2 appropriately on the number line. Those are the values that go on the number line, and now you check regions in the original inequality. I'll let you check regions. Maybe let's just check 0. We'll check x is equal to 0. That would be this region right here. If x is 0, I'll have negative 14 in the numerator. If x is 0, I'll have negative 9 in the denominator. Is that true or false? Well, that's a positive fraction. A positive fraction is not less than or equal to 0, so this is false. If you check a number less than negative 3, it will make the original inequality true. Between 2 and 3, it will make the inequality true. And greater than 3, it will make the original inequality false. Now let's write down our solution in interval notation, and we'll go from left to right. So that will be from negative infinity to negative 3. Now, does negative 3 get a parenthesis or a bracket? Everything gets brackets except numbers that came from the denominator. 3 and negative 3 came from the denominator. Can you see that 3, or negative 3 in this case, cannot have a bracket because x cannot be negative 3? That would make the denominator 0. So I have a parenthesis here, union, and then I go from 2 to 3. 2 can have a bracket, that's okay. 3 cannot have a bracket, it came from the denominator. And there is my solution.